this series, we're heading back to Japan. We'll start off our winter trip sa Nagoya and i-explore natin ang Sapporo and Otaru. And pumunta din tayo sa isang UNESCO Heritage Site. Tara, samahan nyo kami sa Ami Adventure. We're here at Naiya Terminal 3, going to Nagoya. Yay! <laughs> So, andito na kami sa gate 104 and ito yung location ng pa-boarding to Nagoya. So, see you in Nagoya! Bye! It's an emergency. Please pass the cabin And we're ready to go to Nagoya! Sa mga panahon yun, ito po sa Exitos, masayin po lamang ang... Hi! Nakarating na kami dito sa Nagoya, here at Chubo Terminal 2 Airport. And dito sa departure area, dito namin nakuha yung Wi-Fi. Bakit Wi-Fi? Here sa Gilead. So, Pupunta na kami sa Coco Hotel. Let's go! Yung train is going to the city is located sa Terminal 1. You have two options, either transfer there by bus or just walk since marami namang walkalators. Andito na kami ngayon, going to uh, Nagoya City proper. She's, ano, sumakay kami sa Maitetsu Limited Express Train. So, dito, since first class siya, need yung mag-purchase ng tickets. Additional, 360 each. Para makasakay dito kasi first class. On top sa yung regular fare. Okay? So, let's go. So, nandito na kami sa Coco Hotel and here's our room for 04. So, let's go enter this room. Yes! Wow! So minimalist. Okay. So, sakto lang yung size niya. Since as expected sa Japanese nga na hotels. So, maliliit lang din siya. Pero, ano, uh, usable. Functionable. Functionable? May word bang yun? Pahingan muna kami. And, ayusin yung gamit para sa aming next naglakad. Bye! After namin mag-check-in sa hotel, nag-late lunch kami sa Sophia in Sakai Station. Hi! So, pagtapos kami magpahinga from our hotel, ang next itinerary namin is na Bano na Sato. So, nandito na kami sa bus station. Waiting kami sa bus. Here we go! Hi! Nandito na kami sa Bano na Sato. Sobrang lamig today. And as you can see, ang daming mga lights today. Pero ano yan, ano lang to during this season lang. And papasok tayo sa loob para makita natin ang mga iba bang lights. Let's go! Nakabili na kami yung ticket here and it cost to 5 yen. And 1,000 yen yung consumable. Pwede kang bumili ng something sa loob. Let's go! So, 
yun. Tingnan nyo. Pagkapasok tayo sa Nabana sa ito. Ito, makikita nyo. Maraming mga ilaw display. And iba-ibang design. And ano, karamihan dito pinalibutan ng ilaw yung mga puno. Let's go and explore this place. Come on. Yeah! We got kami! Woo! Namana na sana! Ito ang isa sa mga attraction dito sa Nabana na Sata, ang Begonia Garden. So, let's go inside. So, ito yung isa sa mga pinupuntahan dito sa Nabana na Sato, which is dedicated siya sa mga begonia flowers. And here we are in Begonia Garden. So, itong place ito is very memorable to us because dito nag-propose si Merle. So, ayun, so pumunta kami dito and titingnan namin ulit yung area. And actually, same pa din siya, katulad dun dati. Maganda pa din and sobrang ano, nakaka-touch yung play. Yan, so let's go! <laughs> Will you marry me? Thank you! I'll marry you again! Good job, good job! Good job! So, nag-exit na kami dito sa Begonia Garden and let's go our, to our next destination. eating ano takoyaki and chopao beef something di ko malam na ano pa ano beef ah masusaka beef labo sa mga magtour kakaay mo na kami kasi dun sa ano one thousand cube one yata makuha namin san takoyaki sang chopao enjoy hello Andre later And natapos na kami sa aming tour dito sa Nabana na Sato. And this ends our day one here in Nagoya. So tomorrow, pupunta naman kami ng Sapra. Bye! -bye. <laughs> Hi, so ito na kami day two here in Nagoya tour. And pa-check out na kami dito sa Coco Hotel. 
So, mamaya papunta kami na Goya Station para iwan ng aming luggage and papunta na kaming Sapporo. Okay, let's go! Wow. Ay. Okay. So, na Ay, pala muna si Jimmy. Oh, Jimmy. Ka na. <laughs> so, this is 700 per day. Kung gagamit kayo nitong coin lockers, it only accepts 100 yen coins. So make sure na may enough coins kayo. Hello! Nandito na kami sa Nagoya Station and papunta na kami yung Chubo Airlines. So inintay namin yung Mitetsu Express train. So ayan, waiting kami. Around 10.31 yung dating yung train. So let's Oh. Ano naman sasabi mo? Mainit pa dito. Mamaya na lang. Parating na kami dito sa at Chubo Terminal 1. So, pamaya papunta kami ng Sapporo and dito yung flight ng Skymark. So, let's go! Nag-lunch na muna kami before departing for Sapporo since almost 2 hours in yung flight. There are lots of food choices here sa airport like ramen, soba, gyudon, and katsu curry. Kapatok na kami dito sa Skymark and ayun, pagkita na kami sa mga 2 hours yung biyahe namin. And punong-puno ngayon yung plane dahil sa snow festival there in Sapporo. From Feb 5, saan ba? Feb 4. Feb 4 to 11. Okay. So, tingnan natin mga kaya kung anong meron sa Sapporo Snow Festival this year. Yeah, so excited with the fam. See you later. See you later. There are two options going to Sapporo City. One is by bus at Trenay na namin last time, so this time, nag-decide kami to go by train. We purchased a JR Hokkaido Pass through Klook kasi sakto siya sa 40 stay namin ng Hokkaido. Yay! Nakarating na kami dito sa SAP, New Chita, sa airport. So, nandito na kami sa, ano, sa train and papunta na kami sa mismong sa Quara proper. So, let's go! See you in Sapporo. See you in Sapporo. So, nakarating na kami dito sa Sapporo Station. And sobrang lubig kayo ng grabe mo. <laughs> Pero, ayun, pumunta muna kami sa Anna Holiday Inn sa amin. Before kami 
kung gumalagala, mag-check in muna kami. So, let's go. Nakarating na kami dito sa Sapporo and ayun, mag-check in na kami sa Holiday Inn Hotel. Let's go! Wow, so insert natin yung key. Wow! Hindi ang may usok tas. <laughs> ang key ay ganda. Ang fresh. Fresh looking. Yeah, two beds. Lahin ng beds. And then. Ito na ang CR. Parang kamukha siya na CR nung sa ano. Sa last hotel natin. So, yan din siya. Minimalist. Pero mas maluwang luwang to, no? Kesa dun sa last natin hotel. So, papahay nga muna as and magsasettle down. See you later. It's a lot of fun to see the Nika billboard. As you can see, that's it. So, it's so cold today. It's a negative 7 today. So, let's see what we're going to go today. Even though it's so cold. Burger, dito na kami nag-dinner. Approved naman sa kanila ang binili namin burger and melon soda. Katapos na namin kumain sa Moss Burger and parang may snowstorm ngayon. Sobrang lamig at ang lakas ng patak ng snow. Ikaw naman sasabi, Magic. Sobrang lamig, din na ako makasalita. Tapos hindi lang makita masyado. <laughs> Karo siya ulan. Ulan na ano. Bagyo pala, hindi ulan. Pero hindi ka mababasa masyado. Pag natunaw na. Oh. Okay. Ayan. Uh, Spore pa namin Puting ang, na. ang ano nga to? Susukin ng area. Pero baka pumunta namin ng Odori Park. So wala pa yung mga snow sculpture sa ice sculpture. Ginagawa pa lang. Kasi sa Feb 4 pa talaga yung start ng snow festival. So ayan. Let's see kung ano pa makikita namin dito. It's our first day in And this ends our first day here in Sapporo. So, bukas pupunta kami sa snowmobile. And we're gonna do snow snowmobiling. <laughs> so, see you tomorrow. Bye! Hi! Good morning! So, it, this is our second day here in Sapporo. And ayun, pupunta na kami sa snowmobile. So, pupunta kami sa bus station which is somewhere here malapit sa isang hotel. So, samahan nyo kami ngayon and let's enjoy this day, this very snowfall day. <laughs> Go! It takes about 5 minutes walk to our chosen pick-up drop-off point which is Sapporo Tokyo Ray Hotel. We made the reservations at Snowmobile directly on their website. Pero, you can also book through Look. Yung links are on the description of this video. They offer
offer several packages and as for us, ang pinili namin is yung 60 minutes course. They will provide you with coats, jumpsuits, and boots. Pwede rin kayong mag-rent ng gloves kung kailangan. Snowmobile location. Look at their outfit. Cool attire. Kasama ko sa family. Waiting lang kami. Snowmobile. Basta waiting. Basta waiting yung area ka kami. Muntay namin yung Japanese na nag-aasin ko sa akin. Let's see what we're going to do there. There are two 10 minute breaks going to the peak, a chance para mapag photo ops. So, sa amin ngayon sa Snowmobile sa Auburn Saya and pauwi na kami sa aming hotel and ito'y sasakyan namin na bus pauwi. Let's go! After an hour of fun riding the snowmobile, ang next itinerary namin is Lake Shikotsu. There are available tours sa Klook and South Chua bus but naubusan na kami ng slots so for this trip, it will be DIY. Our JR Hokkaido Pass to go from Sapporo Station to New Chitose Airport. Be sure to plan your itinerary ahead since limited lang yung trips ng buses going to and from Lake Shikotsu. Dito kami sa labas ng New Chitose Airport and nasa bus terminal kami. Waiting kami papunta sa Lake Shikotsu. This is under uh, gate 28. Okay. It takes about an hour from the airport to Lake Shikotsu.
So, nakarating na kami dito sa Lake Shikatsu Ice Festival. And look at it. Sobrang ganda. First time namin makakita ng malalaking sculpture na pure ice. Bale, may 500 yen entrance dito. And I think suli siya sa 500 yen. So, let's go! Ikot-ikot tayo dito! Yung last trip ng bus is scheduled at 5.45pm. Tip dito is to go to the bus stop early since mabilis humaba yung pila. Mas mabilis yung biyahe going to the airport. And dito na din kami nag-dinner. Pumili lang kami ng isang ramen shop dito sa New Chitose Ramen Street. Good morning! So, this is our day 3 here in Sapporo. And today, we're going somewhere na first time namin pumunta, just lang. Pero <laughs> second time namin pumunta. At ma-excite din kayo, katulad namin. Pero as you can see, at my back is the Ice Snow Festival. And tapos na yung mga sculptures. Let's go! <laughs> Ayan, nakarating na kayo sa Otary Station. So, let's see ano makikita natin deep here. Let's go! Otaru is a port city here in Hokkaido. Nakilala for its fresh seafood, glassworks, and music box. Dito din matatagpuan ang sikat ng Otaru Canal. We 
haven't had breakfast, and since hindi pa namin na try before mag KFC in Japan, dito na kami nag brunch. Umorder si Jing ng chicken and fries, and itong chicken burger naman sa akin. Where is the KFC here in Japan? Hindi pa namin pa ang nakakain ng KFC dito. Masarap. Mas good, mas malas. Pero yun nga, nakulitin na. Walang space. And walang green. Ayun. So, nandito na kami sa Otaru and sa likod ko is yung Otaru Canal. So, dati siyang fishing port. <laughs> I don't know. It's a fishing. And ayun, ngayon, ano siya, tourist attraction. Pwede ka dyang mamangka and everything. After Otaru Canal, ang next itinerary natin is Otaru Music Box Museum. There is this main street wherein you can find most of the tourist attractions and food stalls. So far, ito yung pinakamasarap na ice cream na natikpan namin dito sa Japan. They also have other matcha products and treats sa pwedeng pambasalubong. We just walked a few meters and ito, food trip na naman. Stall nato is ano Hokkaido beef. Uh, like barbecue. <laughs> We're gonna taste it. Work one fight. Hmm. 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 Dali ako sasabi niya, Dali. Andre, if you were here. <laughs> Speechless. If you were here. Speechless. Sarap. What we liked about Otaru is its laid-back vibes and of course, masayang mag-food trip. Kami wagyu sushi with salmon roll. Panatin. Hmm. Interrupt.
nandito na kami sa bili ng music box. Mamasok kami dyan. And makikita natin iba-ibang music box. After Otaru, babalik tayo ng Sapporo for our next itinerary. Mount Moiwa is one of the known attractions here in Sapporo and is definitely a must visit. Isa itong observation deck wherein you have a panoramic view of the city and dito nyo din makikita yung famous Bell of Happiness. Pagbaba sa Suzukino Station, sumakay kami sa streetcar going to the ropeway Iruguchi Station. Around 30 meters from the station is the Mount Moiwa Shuttle bus stop. This is a free shuttle service and yung interval niya is 15 to 20 minutes. After namin pumunta ang Otaru, pumunta naman kami dito sa Mount Moiwa Ropeway. So, aakit kami sa taas. And we're gonna ride the Chuk Chuk. Okay? Let's go. sa Mount Moiwa Observation Deck. And ito ang makikita nyo.
So, tapos na kami sa Mount Moira Ropeway and pupunta na kami sa, muna sa hotel and later mag-stroll around kami sa Suzuki no area. And titingnan din namin later ang Sapporo Snow Festival, yung mga iba-ibang sculptures doon. Let's go! Sumakay ulit kami ng tram na pa-counterclockwise going to Suzuki no Station. day of walking and sightseeing, tumating na tayo sa exciting part, dinner. Nag-decide kami sa Yoshinoya kumain since sobrang gutom na namin. And grabe, ang sarap ng sukuyaki nila. Nagpahinga lang kami saglit and we're off to our last agenda of the day, the start of the Sapporo Snow Festival 2024. So, nandito na kami sa Adari Park and as you can see, nandito na yung malalaking structures ng snow. Ayan, iba-iba siyang characters and ano, mga, sa mga animatings. And ayun, sa likod din yan is yung tower, Sapporo Tower, 948. So, let's see what we're gonna see. We didn't know na hanggang 10pm lang pala yung lights dito sa Adari Park. Pero nilibot na din namin some of the areas. Sobrang lakas sa ng snowfall, kaya bumalik na kami sa Susukino. Kung snow sculptures ang may kita sa Odori Park, dito naman sa Susukino Street is yung mga ice sculptures. Hello, it's 34 and reporting from Sapporo. <laughs> It's the Sapporo Snow Festival 2024. Ano yes. sabi mo, Jing? Very cold and many sculptures today. Yes. So yun, sa likod namin, makikita niyo sobrang dahil sculptures. Medyo sobrang lakas ng busang snow, kaya medyo muna tayo yung tao in 11pm na. Kaya yan, mag-ingat-ingat pa kami and tignan natin kung ano yung makikita niyo. Okay? Ayan, this ends our day 3 here in Sapporo. 
It's our fourth and last day here in Sapporo, and in this video, pupunta tayo sa isa pang observation deck, and we'll have our first taste of Hokkaido hairy crab. So ano pang inihintay nyo? Tara, samahan nyo kami sa aming adventure! So this is our fourth day here in Sapporo and ngayon bumunta muna kami sa Odori Park in the morning. So nakikita niyo sa likod yung Sapporo Tower. It's already 10:16 a.m. So let's see what we're gonna see. This is our third time in Sapporo, pero it is the first time that we've been to Odori Park in the morning. We can say na it's equally beautiful sa gabi without the hordes of people. After seeing the snow sculptures in Adori Park, mulik muna kami sa hotel to check out. The checkout process of hotels in Japan is quick and easy. Hindi nyo na kailangan maghintay ma-check muna nila yung room. We left our luggage at the hotel, then went back to Odori Park for our next itinerary, which is the Sapporo TV Tower Observatory. The TV Tower is one of the attractions here in Sapporo, and it is located in Odori Park. The observation deck provides a 360 view of the city that is truly a sight to behold. So, nandito na kami sa taas ng Sapporo Tower and makikita nyo yung view ng buong Sapporo.
are lots of stalls and street foods that you can try near the Sapporo TV Tower. Tinanayin namin yung yakisoba na okay lang naman yung lasa and bumili din kami ng mochi with strawberry. Okay, so after namin po wada sa Sapporo TV Tower. Pupunta naman kami dito sa Crab Market and ito yon. Let's go! <laughs> the Sapporo Crab Market is outside the city center. So sasadyan nyo siya talaga. You can buy fresh food here and of course, the specialty nila na crab. We randomly picked a restaurant and we went with this one. They let you pick the type of crab, weigh it, compute the price, and then ask if okay na yun. Pinili namin yung Hakai the Hairy Crab since for us, pricey yung King Crab. The staff even let me hold the live Hakai the Hairy Crab. At ito, dumating na ang pinakahihintay natin na Hairy Crab. They just boiled it and they already made cuts to the shell, kaya madaling niya siyang kainin. So, nandito kami sa loob ng isang restaurant dito sa Sapporo Club Market. Ito yung uh, hairy club na binili namin. First time namin na kainin. Manati! Manamis na. So, kakain na kami dito. As someone who loves crab, sulit na ito for its price. Yung taste na is lightly sweet and mamiti siya, kaya it's good for sherry. So, pabalik na kami sa hotel and ayun, uwi na kami pa Nagoya today. So, Kakakain lang namin dito sa Crab Market. So, bye! Gudi, gudi. My favorite mascot and favorite song. So this is our last day here in Sapporo and ayun, naka-check out na kami dito sa Ana Hotel and we're going back home to Nagoya. See you there! We arrived at New Chitose Airport around 6 p.m. So we had two hours of free time sa airport. Nagstay kami mostly dito sa Sweet Avenue since there are available seats and there are lots of stores that you can buy desserts like ice cream. Nandito din yung pampasalubong like itong rice chocolates.
Entonces, Airpods. 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 So after namin mag dessert, pumunta kami sa ramen street para mag dinner. We went to this ramen shop and I can say na this is one of the best ramen sa tikman ko. Shrimp paste yung broth niya pero hindi malansa and sobrang balance ang lasa. You should definitely try this ramen. flight to Nagoya which is scheduled at 8.45 p.m. So waiting kami dito sa Skymark sa Amboy and papunta kami. Oh, uh, 8.45 p.m. flight namin and 25 minutes pa. So, punong-puno yung airport kaya wala kami makuha. Dito muna kami sa Asahe. Yeah. Many, many people. Yeah. Okay. See you in Nagoya. Nagoya. The travel time from Hokkaido to Nagoya is roughly 2 hours. Buti na lang hindi na-delay yung flight namin, kaya nakaabot pa kami sa last train to Nagoya City proper. Hi! So, nakarating na kami here again in Nagoya from Sapporo. So, medyo ginabi kami eh. Nagsara na yung mga train. Pero madali na kami putan. So, nandito kami ngayon sa Sodezo Frieza Inn. So, naka-check in na kami. Later. So, let's Hindi na kami nakapag-outro dahil sa sobrang pagod. So this ends our fifth day in Japan. And tomorrow, we'll go on a look tour to two of Central Japan's famous attractions, Takayama and Shirakawa Go. It's our sixth day in Japan, and in this video, we're going on a tour to two of Central Japan's famous tourist attractions, Takayama and Shirakawa Go. So, ano pang iniintay nyo? Tara, samahan nyo kami sa aming adventure! We start off our day with a quick breakfast in Mr. Donut, which is included sa accommodation namin. Pagkatapos mag-breakfast, pumunta na kami sa Meitetsu Bus Center for our club tour. Our first stop is Takayama City. This city is located in Gifu Prefecture and is famous for its preserved wooden houses and old street. Similar yung vibe dito sa Gion District in Kyoto.
good morning! So today is yung tour namin pa Shirakagawago and Takayama and currently nag-stop over muna kami here and ito yung makikita nyo yung may bundok sa likod and I don't know anong pangalan, i-add na lang yung mga dyan sa baba pero yan, I'm so excited for today's trip! Keep back! Let's go! After the 20 minutes stopover, pumalik na kami sa bus and we're off to Takayama. We finally arrived at Takayama around 11 a.m. We were lucky na naabutan namin na may snow dito sa Takayama. Sabi ng guide namin, there isn't any snow when she was here a few days ago. Takayama is famous to tourists and locals alike. It's well preserved wooden buildings, traditional shops, which is surrounded by mountains and trees, brings you back to old Japan. Hi! So nakarating na kami dito sa Takayama Village and mag-explore muna kami dito sa area. And as you can see, puro old houses here na dito. So let's go! At eto, nakakita tayo ng shop na may kida beef. Talaga namang melts in your mouth, though price is shot 1,900 yen for 2 pieces of hida beef sushi. Nagmatcha ice cream kami sa nadaanan naming dessert shop at after namin mag food trip, umalik na kami at naghintay sa bus stop for our next itinerary. Tapos na kami mag-tour dito sa Takayama and papunta naman kami sa Shirakawa Go. So papunta na kami sa bus to go there and it's about one hour papunta sa Shirakawa Go. Let's go!
Shirakawa Go is famous for its gacha style houses and is one of Japan's UNESCO World Heritage Sites. The last time we've been here was 6 years ago. It was mid-December and we expected na may snow pero sobrang maulan that time. And now, we're finally back this time and natupad yung pangarap namin na makapunta dito na may snow. There are two options going to the observation deck. You can either walk for 15 to 30 minutes or you can take the shuttle bus in front of the Wada house which is scheduled every 20 minutes. Yung fare dito is 200 yen one way which is reasonable na din. Hi! So nakarating na kami dito sa Shirakawa Go and sobrang ganda. Look at it. Yung mga unique houses na nakaganan. Parang nagpipray na house. So let's see where what we're gonna see here. So, nandito kami sa taas ng Shirakawa Go Observation Deck. And dito, nandito kami sa pilahan ng, ano, ng bus. Pero kanina, pumunta kami dito sa Observation Deck and sobrang ganda. Kita mo ang buong view ng Shirakawa Go with the houses. Okay? And ito na ang end ng aming tour. And next, pumalik na kami ng Nagoya. Bye! So, ayun, pauwi na kami ng Nagoya. Pauwi na kami ng Nagoya. This is our... This is our last day last in day. Japan. Bukas pala, uwi na kami ng Pinas. Yes. Our last uh, activity. Last activity. Yeah, our dog is the higher material. Uh -huh. See you um, in the Philippines. See you in the Philippines. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, Rina, bye na. Nagoya around 7 p.m. So dinner time na. Nag-dinner kami dito sa Misokatsu Yabaton, which is one of our favorites here in Japan. It was founded in Nagoya 60 years ago. They are known for the specialty pork cutlet in red miso sauce. Look, 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 We left our luggage on Nagoya Station a few days ago before we boarded for Sapporo. When we got to the station, hindi namin nabuksan yung locker. Medyo nagpanik lang naman kami cause it's already 9am and 1pm yung flight namin to Manila. We didn't know that there's a maximum of 3 days storage for coin lockers and after that, you need to claim it sa holding facility. Like over 
3 days kami. So, pag over 3 days ako pa yung lover is pupunta tayo dito sa uh, ano, handling station ng oil lover. So, pumunta kami sa somewhere. <laughs> Nakagunta ko. Pero, ilalagay na lang yung world test. So, and, hindi namin makita. So, pag nawala yung handling uh, and yung storage na sa handling station, yung nakikita niya is para ganito. So, ayan. Kita naman na kayo. Ayan, wala may bag. We are going back to the hotel. We are going to check out and we are on our way to the airport. We arrived at Chubu International Airport around 11 a.m. We checked in our luggage and we went to immigration. And after that, we na kami ng boarding which is scheduled at 12.35 p.m. and then nakasakay na kami dito sa Cebu Pacific pabalik to Manila and these ends our trip here in Nagoya, Sapporo February 2024 see you on our next trip bye